Okay, I thought I'd make a quick video, just uh, a an audio editing video to show you how uh, if you have some sort of weirdness in something you recorded, uh, a lot of times there's there's ways to fix it uh, if you can't re-record it. If you're lazy like me and you just don't want to record like three words over and fix it by re-recording it, uh, sometimes you can fix it in the editing process. Um, 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 why am I playing crazy train? I don't know. Um, just something to do, I guess. Um, let me put this guitar down. So in an editing process, um, you can do a lot, but I mean, you can't do miracles, but I just got my phone aimed at the... Uh, TV on my wall so this this is something I just recorded I'm gonna send it in as an audition probably won't get hired but anyway it's just a real short thing but there's a there's a weird sound in this section right here um, let me play it see if you can hear the weird sound today we remember the intentions of our founder Kamome connecting people inspiring Eurasia so in here it, there's a weird high pitch connecting people connecting people connecting people it's like a quirk and it's right in here um if i zoom in a little bit i'm gonna show you how to fix this if you're too lazy to just re-record connecting people <laughs> and fix it or it would take me five seconds no i have to do it the long way but this whole section is got a weird high-pitched sound let me loop it and you can hear it for sure so it shouldn't have a definite pitch in there uh, sh that shouldn't be in there i'm not sure what i what caused it connect it's just some weirdness now it's possible i could just uh delete that let's hear how that sounds I, that may be enough to fix it Connecting people. Connect. Okay. Uh, that sounds fine. Uh, let's get rid of some of that space and listen. Might speed it up. Connecting people. Con mm, it's a little weird, though, without that much space in there. So I could delete that and be fine like I did. Let's hear it like that. Connecting people. That's That sounds okay. But now what I'm going to do, I'm going to undo that. I'm going to show you how if if you weren't able to delete it and it had some important information in there like an SH or an F sound or something that should be there, uh, then you can use an EQ and find those frequencies that are offensive and then just remove them, lower the volume of those frequencies. So the way to do that is you open up an EQ and I have um, an EQ, Graphic e Equalizer an equalizer and here it is right here you can see it and it it only has four bands it just one that comes with wave lap but i only need you know two bands is enough I, i'll enable one of these bands and i what i'll do is i'll pull it up very loud like 20 db but i don't want that big of a bandwidth because that'll give me so many different notes i want to home in on the offensive notes so i'm going to lower the bandwidth See how it's getting narrow? So I'm going to lower the bandwidth way down to where I get mainly the node I'm looking for. I just don't know where where exactly that node is. It's, it's, it's somewhere up in here, I think. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start low, and I'm going to sweep the frequency up the frequency range until I hear that note become offensively loud, and I'll know I've got the note. Um, so that's basically all you do. All right, here we go. See if you can tell when I hit the note. Okay, there's one of them. Now, uh, it's hard to get it. Okay, there it is. It's very hard to fine tune this with a mouse or a graphics pen. 
Now there's another fundamental note in there, or you may even call it a harmonic. We don't really care at this point. We just need to find it. So I'm gonna start above this note and find the next one. So there it is, somewhere right about here. Okay, it's hard to... There's as close as I can get. Now with that, we just reduce them all the way down in volume. And that gets rid of a lot of it, but not all of it. So now we'll render that, okay? And it took out a lot of that. And we just turn it on the EQ again. Turn. So that pretty much do another pass. And it pretty much gets rid of it. And you can even try to do another pass and see if there's another one up here. Yeah, so we can get rid of that one. So anyway, that, that takes out a lot of that note. So if we if we listen now, connecting people, connecting people, it's still in there a little bit, but that's basically the process. You find the notes that you don't like, you don't want to hear by sweeping the EQ across the frequency spectrum and boosting the signal until you find the offensive note and then you just cut it. And that's it. So um, ding people in. and you just repeat that process until you're happy. So it's, you know, it's so there's probably several of those, you know, like that one. And then let's see, it could be. So there's some more of that probably. Anyway, you get the idea. Now I do another pass like that. So it's 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 getting connecting people. it's getting connecting people. So it's almost inaudible now because I've reduced those frequencies about 20 dB every time. Inspiring Eurasia. Okay, so... To that connecting people. Is so, connecting people. There you have it. That if, if that was useful information, then you can just remove those frequencies and then the other information is still going to pretty much be there. Uh, you, you never get something for nothing. You're always going to lose some information, but it's going to be negligible if there's a specific fundamental note that you're hearing. You'll go... You know, I can't even whistle. Ah, ah. So you, you can do it with EQ a lot of times if it's just one note or maybe two. If it's something that's a mouth noise, you can just get rid of it. I was just trying to show you how you could do it with EQ. Um, you can also re-record it if you have the opportunity. So there you go. How to remove an offensive frequency. Um, using an equalizer and sweeping a very narrow band across the range until you hear the note that's offensive, then lower the volume and render it. And you may have to do a couple of different passes, maybe two, even three passes to get it lower in volume so that it's basically not there. And you can see that most of that sound was those notes because there's not much left compared to what it was before I did this process. So hopefully that... Makes sense. Um, maybe somebody, <laughs> somebody will think, wow, that's interesting. <sighs> okay, I just thought I'd make a quick video since I was going to upload this audition. Okay. I guess that's all for now. Maybe I'll upload something more interesting next.